Okay, so this is a short video to give you instructions on how to print your PDF at 100% so that there won't be any measuring issues. I'm at the uh, Quilters Guild of Grand Prairie website. This is the June 2017 newsletter, and it doesn't matter where you got your PDF from. This is just uh, the easiest way for us to communicate, so this is where the links are. You can download the PDF file here and just scroll down to the block of the month. I'll click there and it's actually loading up a file that's already been loaded onto the website. So it comes in pretty quick. It shows me the content and all of these things basically need to be printed at 100%. If you are looking at this on your screen, that is that instead of having a new program open, your browser is holding the, uh, the PDF inside. Make sure that you are able to see the print button. It may be on another side, depending on your computer or your browser. I'll click on that, and uh, it gives me a default option. And more likely than not, you're going to see that one of the options is fit to page. And what this does is that it will make it larger or smaller so that it's the size of the page. You want your print to be at 100%, so I'm going to click on that to turn it off, and now it's at 100%. Got a little bit larger. I'm going to leave the two-sided on checked. I'm going to make sure that I have all my pages, and that when I print, I print them all. And that's pretty much it for the setup. You just click on print. If you manage to actually download the file, as you maybe click on the link with all the instructions, and uh, you clicked instead on the link that is provided for you that says you will need to download templates from here, it might give you this option. Rather than seeing it on the uh, actual website, when I click on download and uh, tell it to put it on my downloads folder, and I'm going to click on save. Actually, I'm replacing the file I already had there. I should have deleted it. Chrome is showing me where it is. If uh, you have Chrome, you can click on that little uh, carrot. Otherwise, find your downloads folder. I'm going to tell it to show the folder. Here's the folder. I'll double click on the file to open it. And I'm basically ready to print. I'll click on the printer icon. I could have gone to file and print. And I want to make sure that uh, same thing. I don't want it to shrink the oversized pages or to fit it to make it smaller. I want to click on actual size. Could also go to custom scale and make sure that that stays at 100, but actual size should be fine. And then you can just click print and you're done.